Yo guys, what is going on and welcome back to a brand new Fortnite video. In this one, I'm going to be showing you guys everything that has changed in Wailing Woods in the new Season 6 update. Now, for the past two seasons, there has been a bunker located in Wailing Woods with a bunch of people trying to figure out how to crack it open, what's inside, and you know, what exactly is going on with the storyline behind this bunker. Now, the developers of Fortnite have already said that sometime in Season 6, this bunker will for sure be getting open. Now, they have made some small changes to Wailing Woods if you do land here now, however the bunker itself is still shut close. Now if we take a look inside some of the houses here in Wailing Woods, we will actually see that there are still a few hidden basements and a few hidden bunkers located underneath these houses as well. So I'm going to show you guys exactly what's underneath here and take a look at the, everything that's down in this new Wailing Woods area. Now the main bunker itself still is shut like I said before, so I'm thinking that sometime throughout the season somewhere down in this area you know things are going to be changing quite frequently and you know as the season progresses we will see the bunker open sometime towards the end now if you guys come down into any of these new houses that have been adding into Wailing woods there are actually a bunch of hidden hallways and little places where you can break through the walls to find other hidden areas now keep in mind there may be chests here if you guys come down here in other maps you know i might have gotten unlucky and didn't really get many chest spawns here in these houses but other than that guys, I'm just going to show you guys everywhere that you can explore throughout these new tunnels. There's actually tunnels located in all of the houses here at Welling Woods. And some of them actually do connect with each other once you find the correct hallway. So that is what that building looks like. Now we, I ended up taking out that enemy and as you guys can see here, the bunker is still completely shut closed. But the houses all around it do have a bunch of hidden basements where you can travel underground. It just doesn't connect with that bunker just yet. So we're going to head over into the second house here and see if we can find any more hidden locations inside this house. Whether it's a hidden basement, something behind a bookcase, or just, you know, a hidden doorway. Maybe something that will lead us down into that bunker. Now they have hidden a bunch of little teddy bears down here, which is pretty much a classic sign of being an easter egg or something like that. Now, I'm not sure if that's going to be a challenge later on, sometime maybe for the battle pass or not, but they do like to hide teddy bears around the map to symbolize the easter eggs that are coming in the game. Now if we take a look behind this bookcase, you'll actually see that there is an entire hallway underneath this basement that you guys may have missed if you did come down here. Now overall, the loot wasn't all that great for me, so I don't think I'm going to be dropping here all that often, but this is something that we're going to have to keep an eye on for the rest of the season as the map progresses and as things change, we will most likely see some changes to these basements and that Whirling Woods bunker. So hopefully you guys do enjoy the rest of the tour throughout this area, and I will see you guys in my next Fortnite video. Peace.